Hi guys, Dr. Albert here. In this video, we will be talking about 10 ingredients that you should look out for and avoid when purchasing hair products. Now these hair products include shampoos, conditioners, hair gels, hair mousses, hair sprays, hair masks, and so forth. Now, according to research, there are 10 ingredients that you should definitely avoid when purchasing hair products. And the first one being are sulfates, such as sodium lauryl sulfate. Now, sodium lauryl sulfate is an aggressive chemical. It strips the hair and the scalp of its natural oils. And over time, it leaves the hair feeling brittle. It leaves the hair feeling um, dry and it causes a lot of split ends. The second ingredient that you definitely want to avoid is mineral oil. Now, mineral oil does leave the hair feeling um, glossy and shiny, but it doesn't penetrate the hair fibers and it doesn't help with existing hair damage. The third ingredient that you definitely want to avoid are parabens. Now, according to research, parabens are preservatives that are linked to cancer. The fourth ingredient that you want to avoid are alcohol. Now, alcohol is a drying um, agent and over time it causes the hair feeling dry. The fifth ingredient that you definitely want to avoid are fragrances. Now fragrances cause a lot of skin reactions, irritations, causes dermatitis. So you definitely want to avoid the word fragrance when purchasing hair products. The sixth ingredient that you want to avoid are formaldehyde. Now formaldehyde, according to research, is a known carcinogen, so you definitely want to stay away from that ingredient when purchasing hair products. The seventh ingredient that you want to avoid is coal tar, and according to research, it's also linked to cancer and to brain damage. Now the eighth ingredient that you want to avoid is silicone. Now silicone weighs the hair down, it causes the hair feeling dull, and it also causes a lot of dryness and brittleness over time. The ninth ingredient that you want to avoid are phthalates. Now phthalates causes a lot of permanent damage to the hair. So when, when uh, you're using these products that contain a lot of phthalates, you won't see any um, improvement in the hair growth because it causes a lot of damage and a lot of brittleness and um, dryness. Now the 10th ingredient that you want to avoid is PPD. Now PPD is paraffinyl nelodiamine. Now it causes a lot of allergic reactions and it increases UV sensitivity. Now my friends at Karina Organics were kind enough to send me a few of their products to try and after trying them for a couple of weeks I absolutely love them. So definitely check them out. They were kind enough to send me their um, deep treatment conditioner in the citrus scent and not only does it smell absolutely amazing but the ingredients are clean they're organic, they are chemical free, and I absolutely love and I feel safe using them. Now another product that they were kind enough to send me was their shampoo and body wash. So for those that are in a rush, this two-in-one is the way to go. The third product that they were able to send me was their alcohol-free styling gel, and I absolutely love this. It's in the sweet pea scent, and I know from their website that they also have a scent free for those that um, don't like any, uh, you know, don't want to have any scents in their products and that's completely fine. So they do have the unscented um, products on their website. So definitely go ahead and check Karina Organics. I'll leave the link down under, under the video below. Let me know what your comments are. I hope you enjoy this video. Thanks and we'll see you in the next video.